What's up, Tactical Gamers? Are you ready for a Grey Zone Warfare like many others are? Well, stick around so I can give you the latest information on Grey Zone Warfare Early Access and other important information. But first, let's talk about this week's past playtest. I know some of you are very new to Grey Zone Warfare, so if you're looking for anything and everything Grey Zone Warfare, you have came to the right place. I highly believe this game will be the next big tactical shooter, but first they need to fix some major issues. More on this in another video, so stay tuned. I speculate there's a chance for another playtest, and if there is and I get keys, I'll be handing those out to subs and whoever is in the Discord. So join my Discord, it's in the description below. Hopefully they do choose to do an open to all sign-up test because I know for a fact that would bring even more people to Grey Zone Warfare. And that the community itself will find a ton more bugs because the vast majority is not worried about making videos like these content creators are, and myself. And I know some close friends who have broken similar games before, like Escape from Tarkov. Shout out to the contractor who has broken multiple things in Escape from Tarkov and found a game-breaking server crashing glitch that had something to do with magazines as you could see here in the video. If they release Grey Zone Warfare and there are game breaking glitches and bugs like this, it will make for a bad experience and a lot of frustration. In a recent podcast on the Pogcast with Jesse and Veritas, Mara stated he's creating the experience, not the frustration. This was directed at Escape from Tarkov's frustrating experiences. I hope he stays true to his word and gives the game the time it needs for enough optimization to where people are not turned off from the game and actually give it a chance. In my opinion, Madfinger Games should give Grey Zone Warfare at least, at the minimum, 30 more days to fix everything they can. This will make for a more enjoyable experience. The last thing they should want is anyone to refund this game and leave a bad review due to something that could have been fixed easily before early access, especially if it would have only taken them another month, you know, to fix these major issues. However, I will not complain if Grey Zone Warfare would release like tomorrow. I'm just simply wanting what's best for the game and it to have its best chance. Because in the end, they only get one shot at this. And to be honest, I was one of those people who just completely refunded games like Ready or Not, Zero Hour, Ground Branch. I gave those games not much of a chance. It was fun whenever I had the game, but I, it just wasn't for me. I, I didn't see any improvement with it. But Grey Zone, on the other hand, it, it took me from the beginning just with like a minute of footage i was like man this this is going to be the game for me and i'm so happy i stuck around and started making these videos for you guys some things that people have stated that has me quite worried are quotes like this i don't see myself able to tolerate this game more than a week in its current state i'm not gonna tell you who said this it's that's wrong for me to do that if I would. I'm not sure why this person stated this exactly, but it seems like some people are on edge with Grey Zone Warfare and getting really frustrated, probably because they're playing the game wrong, and others are extremely satisfied, and those are the people that's probably playing the game right. Shout out to Timmy Tenders, or, uh, well, Timmy Tactical now, but uh, he's been covering the game and doing a really swell job, so... Uh, Check out that channel, guys. With that being said, I have er overheard some creators saying perhaps a week after the test, the game will release. But uh, we're not totally sure on that. Hopefully tomorrow, we will get some questions answered because on April 25th, tomorrow, Friday, in the official Grey Zone Warfare Discord, we will have the roundtable talk with Mara and I believe Rick's going to be there also. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to ask questions or if they already have some questions written down, but we will get answers to some questions. Hopefully those are some that we really, really want, like release date, then another test, all those things. But uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and let's do this, boys.